got it. Watch this. We're gonna go four piece cluster here. What's going on? Thanks for checking in. Today we have the college squad coming through. It's winter break. Everybody's home for the holidays. They have about a month in here with me before they start their spring. This is arguably, in my opinion, the most important training time in a college athlete season. So this is their time to build and turn heads and work on what their college coach told them to work on during their exit meetings to show up to spring a completely different animal. So if you're a college player, this is one you're not gonna wanna miss. Make sure you stay tuned, check this one out. All right, so here it is. Here's what we got rolling today. At first glance, this may look like a lot, but fortunately for my guys in here, they all have been building on my Summers Method Plus app this entire fall. So they're ready to go. They're ready for this workload. We can hit the ground running. First thing we're gonna do is come in, hit our movement prep. We have four movement prep exercises today. Hip mobility dominant here. I like to say, hey, if you have your car, tires flat, you better fill up that tire before you hit the rest of the road. So we'll hop into our primer right after that. This is your high velocity stuff for neuro priming so the body works better throughout the rest of our workout. Three rounds. We'll start at the mat. And we're gonna go repeated tuck jump all the way down to the mound. So go ahead, first man up, follow. Repeated tuck jump. You might be able to go two at a time. Go ahead, hit it. You'll be able to hit the lift. You should be able to hit the lift. Just do pogo jumps as you can don't tuck your legs you should be good hey try to hit yourself in the chest with those legs cycle it cycle it cycle it walk it back and then hit it again last one hit it be super fluid. The ground is lava here. Kiss it and come up. Go. Walk it on back. Now we'll get out for distance. Get out for distance. Don't land on the mound. After our primer, we're gonna go ahead and check their RSI, so reactive strength index on the force plates. I have all their previous numbers before we sent them out to school this fall. So we're gonna see how those numbers are lining up, seeing if they stay disciplined on their program throughout the fall. From there, we're gonna move into a strength power PAP complex. So we're killing two birds with one stone. We're hitting max strength, single leg strength with the reverse lunge. And after that, we're tricking ourselves into producing more power at high contraction velocities with that single leg triple jump. If you've been following me for a while, you know I'm real big on post activation potentiation. So stimulating your nervous system, tricking it to produce more power. Here, we're gonna roll with the gym aware so we make sure we're getting big strength adaptation. So we wanna keep that bar between 0.5 and 0.8 meters per second for that set of three. Take that rest off and then hit our single leg triple jump. Take about a two minute break because we don't want fatigue to outweigh potentiation. Hop back through it, we're gonna go four to five times on that. If that bar velocity starts dipping at that weight, we're gonna kill the set. Thank you. 
Point nine. Fast, point eight, come on, faster. Point seven, four, last one. Point nine, right here, get it. Big. Point eight, four. Good shit. Moving it. Three bills. That's a 65 pound bar too. That's what it takes right there. That's what it takes. From there, we're gonna go into our accessory build complex. A lot of these college coaches will say, hey, you just gotta throw on size this fall or this winter break. So to do that, we're gonna go in and try to build some hypertrophy in our little bit higher rep ranges. So we have a slump buster, which is our way of saying glute bridge. So we're gonna go glute bridge for eight. Then we're gonna go single leg RDL for eight. And we're gonna go heels elevated goblet for eight. So how I like to program, if we're doing a big strength move with single leg, which is our reverse lunge, during our accessory build complex, I like to sandwich one single leg between two bilateral exercises. And then the next day of the week, so today's Monday, Thursday we'll hit our next lower, I will do the exact opposite. So we'll go bilateral heavy strength, and then we'll sandwich uh, two single leg exercises in with one bilateral exercise. So this is what we got. Thanks for tuning in. Listen, if you wanna use the same exact training program that my elite college athletes use in-house, make sure you sign up for our brand new Summers Method Plus app. That is a year round training program, whether you're a youth player, a high school player, college player, or professional player. And the best part is you can get a seven day free trial. Click the link in the description. And always remember I'm pumping out weekly content on this YouTube channel. Make sure you subscribe for me. Appreciate you, we'll catch you next week. Game rewards the grind, it knows how much you've invested.